take a look at the JS and CSS guidelines. Um, use tails CSS classes uh, to be polished, responsive, and visually stunning interfaces. That's interesting. I I wonder uh, if this is uh, this is a little bit of like create polished, responsive, and visually stunning interfaces, right? It's kind of like giving context to your um, kind of like prompt engineering, right? Like what kind of images you want to generate, right? That kind of thing. So uh, cool to to know that this is maybe that creates nice interfaces. Uh, no longer needs tailwind config, yada, yada, yada. Uh, that, that makes sense. That's kind of an error that it, that it runs into, I guess. Always use and maintain this import syntax in the app CSS file for projects generated within Phoenix new. All right. Never use apply. <laughs> nice. Uh, always manually write your own tailwind based component instead of using Daisy UR for a unique world class design. Nice. Another thing, another little tip here. I think like that's right. Another little prompt thing so that it, uh, it knows what kind of thing to, to generate, or it adds a little flavor to it, I imagine. Uh, out of the box, only the AppJS and AppCSS bundles are supported. Uh, you cannot reference an external vendor script <laughs> in the layouts. You must import the vendor depths into apps. Never use inline custom JS scripts within templates. Makes sense. 